<laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, this is Dewey Fart Razor Nelson. I can't, well, you know, I feel like the pressure's on now, so Sean Pressure Hole Eastridge. Richie Glory <laughs> Toll <F-E-O. laughs> It's uh, Alex the Asshole Beard. Dude, lots of poles. Emily like the that. normal person in the car. Yeah. Yay, we got a normal person in the car. <laughs> you can tell the can difference see? between the normals and the holes. Normal. I mean, I, I'll just leave it at that. Normal. Can you see the wrist slicer? Oh, okay. <laughs> Call a doctor. We All right. Dark we just had a whole bunch of nicknames for a movie. The movie we just saw was Catching Fire. Hunger Games colon. <laughs> just to bring it back to holes. <laughs> catching Fire. Colon. Everybody's got a colon, so let's talk about ours. How, how does your colon feel right now, Sean? Well, my colon is feeling quite happy. My colon was a bit underwhelmed by the, the book catching fire. I enjoyed the first... More of a semicolon. <laughs> God damn you. you Alright, so I enjoyed... My, my colon enjoyed the first Hunger Games book. It enjoyed the first Hunger Games movie. I wasn't bowled over by either, and I certainly wasn't bowled over by catching fire, the book. I felt like it was kind of... Uh, Repetitious? Is that a word? It was a bit. No, it was, <laughs> it was a bit. Uh, it's my favorite. Too, it was a too, bit too similar to the first book. Um, but I thought this movie was actually better than the first movie. It was very good. Uh, it was a lot of fun, and it was dramatic. It was dark, and it left you hungry because it's the Hunger Games for the third one. Here, here, I agree. I feel like this movie uh, was a little bolder than the first one. It took some steps that were needed. It was bold. It was bolder, Colorado, and it left me wanting to shoot for more. I, this is not, that's not, that's not a joke. That's not funny. <laughs> Don't laugh at my review. You guys, every time, every time. Right, let's, let's, uh, let's get some, let's, some let, let, let's, let's hear from the, the from the little people. So, uh, November, I learned one thing today, uh, November, uh, 22nd, for everyone who doesn't see it at, uh, 9 o'clock or midnight, uh, November 22nd was the day that, uh, American Woman died. The song? Yep, the song. American Man. Poor old Lenny Kravitz. And that Kravitz. has what to do with the movie? Yeah, because... Lenny Kravitz was in the movie, that's oh, why. Oh, okay. Guys, now we get with the pop culture. <laughs> Is this an Austin Powers crossover? I'm confused. Can I say something? Today's the 21st. I'm confused. Well, it's coming out tomorrow, <laughs> damn it. Oh, oh, so we're living in the future! I, I We're living in the future and none of this has happened yet. Like <laughs> get like get your holes ready. Negative Raise your holes up high. All right, let's get this going. We need to. You know what? There's a lot of hole raising. Yeah, a lot of I'm a hole raiser. Uh, we, hole I, I would like I, I would like the ladies' opinion on what everybody thinks oh, about PETA. Yeah, How do we? So hot. I'm hugging yeah, my cup. Let's have a man's hugging your what? My cup. Say that one more time with a P at the end. Of it. I'm hugging my pup. Okay, no, I just wanted to make sure that what we were hugging here. What, what are you? What does Peter make you hug? Um, um, things that I can't talk about in this car. Let, There's too many people in here. Them, oh. I will talk all day. Let me tell you what Peter. Ma- what I want Peter to hug. It's uh. We're gonna play a little game. You take the first half of his name and add Nis at the end. It's kind of like Katniss, but you take out the first part of her name Katniss? and put in the first part of of Peta's name, and you get a special you word. And I'm gonna let this you at home figure it out. Penis. Put it together. Pentapleness. I wonder if his penis is catching fire because we're talking about it. I got Speak, Speaking of catching fire, what? who else wants to talk I about the movie? <laughs> <laughs> That's a fine idea, Sean. <laughs> I really liked it. I thought it was a great movie. I had a lot of fun with it. Uh, and you know what? Who knew that you could have so much fun with, with characters that were so miserable? <laughs> nobody, is, <laughs> nobody is happy in this movie ever. I hope the there's. A, I hope the third one has another Hunger Games. I That's all I'm saying. Is. I hope they have a full buffet. At the third <laughs> personally, personally, for me, I really wanted to have that drink that makes you throw up. That way, I could consume more of the Hunger Games. Yes, it's called alcohol. <laughs> I can't wait for them to invent that. Yes, now sure. we've got a li- we got about a year to go before the third one comes out, which I don't know anything about, and I don't want to know anything about it. But they're splitting that into two parts, which I don't know if that, that is. Confirmed? Yeah, that's happening. That's the trend. Do we? And I don't know how I feel about it because it feels like they could have had a really strong trilogy here. They've got a really good. Uh, they had a, a good 
opening. They had a really good second a one. Great cast. And they get great, great cast. Great the cast, cast, I think, makes it. Because reading the book, I didn't really get a lot of emotional involvement in it. And what? they've got, I mean, you got Woody Harrelson. <laughs> you got Philip Seymour Hoffman. You've got... It's like, it's like the American Harry Potter. It's like like the American cast of Harry Potter. Yeah. I mean, I'm not saying They're like the everybody books. In there. Like, mm. They're getting everyone in. Everyone gets a little dirty. No one comes out with their hands clean. Just like this car. <laughs> That's the way I like it, you know? Anybody else feel that way? Did you, you see... read the books before you saw the first I, movie? I, I read the first book and then immediately saw the first movie. I read the first book in less than 24 hours, and I immediately went out. It was my first date with my girlfriend, Sarah. Oh. We, we went right out, Perfect. and uh, we participated in our very own Hunger Games, and we won. I never want to know what that means. <laughs> uh, I think there was some disagreement here about uh, the feelings... Of the uh, uh, of the book, I heard something from this corner of the car. Oh yeah, I love the book. The and, and and there was a, I think Sean said something that there was some, there was a fisticuffs, a verbal fisticuffs going on, uh, but that was not that was unvoiced. <laughs> Looks like it will remain unvoiced. I don't remember what it was. I'm gonna say something because please do. I saw the first movie before I read the books, so as I read the second and third book, I was picturing the characters as they were in the books. So the second book is actually my favorite book of the series. See, you know, and I, I, w I did the same exact thing except I pictured all the characters naked. Dude, you too. Who said I didn't oh do God. that too? I thought the movie we watched everybody was. See, I did. I couldn't do that, so I just watched the movie <laughs> naked myself. I was, I was I was really nervous, so I just imagined everybody wasn't wearing clothes in the movie. I just as I was in the watching it for like thirty minutes. I missed half of the movie. Thirty. It was an hour long movie. <laughs> <laughs> it was. Well, it was a, it, they did it was a, a BBC they special. Did a they did a lot with that one Look, hour. I I was DVRing like five things at the same time. So uh, Man, at yeah. this point, you should just turn off this review and listen to the Thor review because <laughs> that review is great. Hey, why don't we just talk about Thor? For... Think about Thor. All right, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> I feel like we've covered as much ground as we can. Let's let's give it. How many mocking jays do we give this movie? It's a very good point, Sean. All right, so, all right who wants to start mocking jays? I'm gonna give it four mocking jays. Oh. It loses half a jay because <laughs> like I just did. <laughs> loses half. It loses half. Well, I'll just say it loses a whole, a, a whole jay or, a, or a jay hole. <laughs> as they call it in, in this part of, this, of the colonies. Um, because I, 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 the whole movie, I was like, oh man, I really like this movie. I really like these characters. I'm really invested in this. Oh, this is great. Oh, this is good. Oh, this feels like this is the part where, you know, if they're trying to set up for two more, an extra sequel. That and that was served. just the hand job I was giving him. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> I just <laughs> ended though out of nowhere. Yeah. I f well, I mean, the book is the book ends whatever. exactly the same way too, and you do kind of get that feeling of like, oh, oh my god, you know, blue balls. You know what it I'm talking about? It was a metaphor. They just poured water on the end of the fire. And just, the hmm. end. <laughs> so how many how many J holes do you give it? You gave it oh, Alex, go ahead. How many how many what do I give J holes? It? J holes. How many J holes do I give it? I give it a solid four and a half J holes oh, out of wow. buttholes. Oh, wow. Yeah. It's more holes than you can shake a stick at. And I think the only reason why it gets that point five extra is because we didn't see this movie in 3D, and there were multiple times that things came out at me at the screen and I got scared. Casey <laughs> saw it. Yeah. <laughs> The monkey made uh -oh. me jump. The monkeys made me jump. Oh, that is, sounds like a horrible children's nursery rhyme. <laughs> the monkeys made me jump. <laughs> the monkeys made me jump. All right, next the <laughs> I'm next, and I gave this movie, I will give it four J-holes. I was on the edge of my J-hole for a lot of the movie, and I that feel... Was my <laughs> by the way. I was on the edge of Sean's J-hole for the whole movie, and uh, 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 I feel like it was a vast improvement on the first one. The first one did not make my, my whole J, and this my I would... It's cracked on the surface of your hole. Uh, yeah, no, we... Between your J holes. This, my, my J hole surface has been split wide open, <laughs> and I feel like I, it, it is ready to welcome two more movies. So uh, I dock at a hole because... Um, it, you know, I wish I would more. I was more satisfied at the end. It just was about. It was jang my hole the whole movie, and right at the end, it just frost bit me right where I don't want to be bitten. Where I want to be frost smitten, I was frost bitten. It fit, yeah. But so that's why I, I give it the four. But it was it was pretty pretty solid. I feel bad for your J hole. 
you don't want to know. <laughs> um, who uh, who else need, has a whole rating? Um, I'm gonna give it four and a half only because I feel like there was important relationship stuff left out. But other than that, other than that, solid from um, the book. Do, but I didn't read the book. <laughs> I give it a four because I think I would have enjoyed it better if I didn't read the book for first. Mm, too much information going in. How many holes do you give the book? I how give I give the the, the book five. Five yes, whole books. Out of how many holes? Um, five. 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 What scale are you let there be no end to the holes. Can I just put that out there? I can't put my butt I, anymore. I feel like we're re- we're a really boring critical team because we all gave Thor the same amount of holes. It, well, no, I gave Thor three, three and a half. You gave it hammers. We gave it hammers. So well, we all gave it three and a half hammers. And I'm gonna go ahead and give this four. We're gonna give this four holes. Um, I really, I really enjoyed it. I thought it was a much more confident and uh, emotionally sound adaptation than the first one. The first one felt very much like they, w- it, it was, it was good, but it, it was missing that spark, that spark that caught fire and they, catching they, fire. And you can't <laughs> but, uh, start a fire. And you can't start a, uh, you can't start a fire without a spark. Um, I will dock at a point because at the end of the. At the end of the, the blah, 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 at the end of the day, uh, it still to me feels like they have a beginning, an end, and then the first Hunger Games in the middle. Um, it feels like they kind of hit a lot of the same beats. It, it didn't bother me as much in the movie because it felt like I got the emotional resonance. But there wasn't that many dead kids. Yeah, there weren't there weren't as many dead kids, which is uh, which that's also so why I knocked it off a hole. <laughs> Having less, it doesn't de- make me so much harder, and that's my problem. Citizen. Having <laughs> less kids <laughs> makes it so much harder for me to jerk off to this film. Yeah. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I feel like sh- Alex actually just sort of like summed up I, how we all feel. I feel like I just participated <laughs> in the Hunger Games. <laughs> <laughs> all right, well, thank you for joining us for our first impression of Catching Fire. Uh, now you can go, n- go catch yourself. some fire to yourself. <laughs> I was going to get there. All right. Goodbye.